So here we have a four mark question for a non-calculated paper. Last year, Kerry's take-home pay was £15,000. She spent 40% of her take-home pay on rent. She used the rest of her take-home pay for living expenses, clothes and entertainment in the ratio of 3, 1 to 2. How much did Kerry spend on entertainment last year? And this is a four-mark question. So we're looking to do uh, four things to get all the marks. So let's start off with the first bit. Last year, Kerry's take-home pay was £15,000. She spent 40% of her take-home pay on the rent and she used the rest of the thing. So we need to work out 40% uh, of the 15000 that she spent on rent and so then we know the 60% that she's got to spend on everything else. So that's going to be our first step. So we've got uh, £15,000. is 100% of her wages. So if I said, well, let's have a look at 10% of her wages, that would be uh, £1,500. And so we're looking to find 60% of her wages because she's going to spend 40 of them on rent, so 60% is used for everything else. So 60% of her wages is six times 1,500. So I could just do a little sum at the side if I couldn't do it in my head. Six zeros are zero, six zeros are zero, five six is a thirty, carry a three, one six is six, add three is nine thousand. So she spends nine thousand pounds. Nine thousand pounds. I'll just write that down, I think, just to make sure I'm getting the marks from the examiner. I'm gonna write nine thousand um, pounds used for uh, uh, expenses, <coughs> excuse me, expenses, clothes, and entertainment. And it's worth writing a sentence like that so you can show what you've done. <coughs> right, next thing. Uh, she used the rest of these for, cl uh, for expenses, clothes, and entertainment in the ratios of 3 to 1 to 2. So then the ratios of 3 for expenses one for clothes and two for entertainment. Um, okay, so nice little trick here. We can see that three parts of what she's spending here is on expenses. And if I added the clothes and the entertainment, then that's three parts spent on clothes and entertainment as well. So I'm just gonna go three to three and I'm just gonna add these, th these two together. So now I know I've got three parts for expenses and three parts for clothes and entertainment, then I can split my 9,000 equally between these two because three to three is the same as the ratio is one to one. So I know that 9,000 pounds is the total and I can spend 4,500 on expenses and I can spend 4,500 on clothes and entertainment. Okay, so now I know that I've spent 4,500 on clothes and entertainment. And again, it's worth taking the time used for clothes and entertainment. The examiner likes to see you writing something to explain what you're doing. And we know that the ratio is uh, one part on clothes, two parts on entertainment, so it's one to two. <clears throat> so I now need to split up my total of 4,500 in the ratio of 1 to 2. So one of the techniques of doing this, if I've got one part on clothes and two parts on entertainment, that's three parts in total. So for every, if I spend one pound on clothes, I'm spending two pounds on entertainment, which means I'm spending in three pound blocks of money. So how many three pound blocks of money do I get if I divide mine? I'm just going to go upside down the way I do this, 4,000. £500. So I'm dividing £4,500 into £3 blocks of money. 3 into 4 goes 1. Carry 1. 3 into 15 goes 5. And put my zeros in. So I've got 1,500 blocks of fifteen of £3. £3. So that means I can now times that by 1,500 and times that by 1,500. So that makes £1,500 and two lots of £1,500 is £3,000. And we can just visually check that. Two parts is £3,000, one part 
into 1,500, so twice as much as entertainment as she does on clothes. And together they added up to 4,500, which we know that because that's what we figured it out to be. So go up and check our question. How much did Kerry spend on entertainment? So I now know that Kerry spent £3,000 on entertainment. I'll just put my answer down here just to make sure. 